Uh, hello, my name is Ruben Langdon. Um, I play the role of Dante in Devil May Cry 3 and uh, the upcoming Devil May Cry 4. Yeah, this is uh, the, well, we first, our company, Just Cause Productions, uh, uh, Takuya Shibata and myself, uh, we were approached to, um, or I guess we heard about Devil May Cry 4 and we were approached in the same sense as Devil May Cry 3 uh, to work on the script and to, um, to hire the t talent and uh, casting for Devil May Cry 4. Uh, as far as the, Don the role of Dante, it was kind of up in the air. Um, it wasn't really decided it was going to be me or not uh, because it was an older Dante and, and I guess everybody had their doubts uh, whether or not I could play the role of Dante. So, um, so I had to go through the same process that the other actors went through and uh, go through the auditioning process and uh, you know, do two or three auditions and, and finally they decided on me as Dante. So it wasn't decided right away and I wasn't approached at the beginning to play the role of Dante, it was kind of uh, going along the process. But our company, uh, in which I was also involved in the casting, was involved with uh, the overall casting process. You order the sword, huh? Yes. Are you familiar with them? Sorry, religion and I don't mix. It's a small congregation that gathers in the castle town of Fortuna. I guess the only people who would have heard of it are the ones who take interest in this type of thing. <laughs> like you. Exactly. So, so, so yeah, and, and, and compared to part three, when I, um, you know, you see the finished product, this time it's a lot more detailed. You, there's the facial expressions and the, um, you know, the clothes they're moving and the hair and everything. It's all there. It's like, it's, it's almost real. Um, where we didn't have that in three, so you're, you're moved or, you know, you're, I moved that much more <laughs> than three. I mean, three was amazing, and four now is just the detail and the technology, and you know, with Capcom and their uh, their their graphics, everything is it's mind mind boggling. You summon and kill. Summon and kill. I fail to see the logic here. Price to pay for power. So um, it's probably the the, uh, the hardest scene, but on the other hand, the most uh, enjoyable scene was uh, there's a, a scene where Dante and Agnes are uh, on stage performing. Not well, not really performing. They're uh, they're having a, a scene <laughs> together, and um, the scene was as if they were performing on the stage. So uh, all the movements and uh, uh, the dialogue even was very, um, I don't know, uh, stage-like, I can say. Um, but that scene, just that kind of acting and that kind of, uh, uh, those kind of movements were very challenging. But at the same time, like I said, I had a blast. I encourage! This time, mean, Shimomura is putting his magical touch on it. And So, uh, yeah, for the, the action bits, um, I mean, some of the stuff that shimona san was asking us to do was it's crazy. And, you know, we're trying to imagine it because it's in a three-dimensional world and we're kind of cheating a lot of the movements and things. But um, I'm sure, you know, he's, he's, uh, this has been, he's had a lot of other experience in between Devil May Cry uh, as myself and, and some of the other performers. So, you know, with that added experience on top of Devil May Cry 3, I'm sure Devil May Cry 4 is going to be kick-ass and everybody's going to have a good time. What took you so long? You. What are you doing here? Forget it. I don't have time for this. And neither do I. So I'll cut to the chase. Ah! 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 
I'm here for the sword. So yeah, I mean, when you when you're doing uh, the, uh, did the motion capture and the voice and everything for for Devil May Cry three and or four and the uh, the whole process, it's no different than you know a Hollywood movie, uh, especially now. The, the more and more games were getting closer to movies, and uh, I guess the techniques used to create Devil May Cry 4, it's the same exact techniques uh, I'm doing right now in, uh, in Avatar for Mr. James Cameron. And uh, having, actually having the Devil May Cry 4 experience probably helped me, has been helping me with, uh, with this with the film I'm doing now, but uh, Devil What's May Cry name? 4 is it's a Hollywood movie level, I guess I could say that, and at least in the, the creation of it, and the, the planning and the, the time that's going into it, it's, it's the same thing, so different. Neither is yours. So, um, everybody, I'm sure, like I just said, uh, Don't May Cry 4, it's, uh, it's a lot of the same guys, myself, Shimomura, Mr. Itsuno, um, the Lynx crew were we're, uh, we're back, we've got more experience than before, and I'm sure we're, um, it's gonna be a kick-ass experience for you all, so check it out.